One of the reasons for the acceleration of the development of the KAN, formerly TFX, stealth fighter jet is that Turkey's air power is so dependent on US-made fighter jets. As is known, the Turkish Air Force's fighter backbone rests on the F-16 Fighting Falcon and F-4 Phantom II variants. Especially the latter, whose reputation is phenomenal, because it has been in operation for almost five decades, even though the Turkish F-4 Phantom II is old, in fact, the fighter jet produced by McDonnell Douglas is still actively operated by the Turkish Air Force on the front line. And at the 2023 Anatolian Eagle AE, multilateral air training event, which was attended by Turkey, Azerbaijan, Pakistan, Qatar, the United Arab Emirates and the United Kingdom, the F-4 Phantom II still appeared strong, especially in carrying out the air-to-surface attack aspect, as a country synonymous with technological advances, the F-4 Phantom II currently operated by Turkey is not a standard variant. In 2007, Turkish Aerospace Industries started a project to modernize the F-4 Phantom II fighter already in the inventory of the Turkish Air Force. This project aims to increase the capability and operational life of the aircraft. To realize this intention, Turkey is collaborating with an Israeli company, Israel Aerospace Industries, in this project. IAI is considered to have extensive experience in developing and modernizing fighter aircraft, particularly the F-4 family. The deal with IAI is valued at 632 million US dollars, which includes upgrading 54 of the approximately 200 F-4 ES the Turkish Air Force has. This configuration became known as the Terminator 2020 configuration of the 54 aircraft. About half were modified by IAI in Israel with new avionics systems, which were originally destined for Israel's Furnace Phantom program before being scrapped. The remaining airframes were upgraded in Turkey via kits provided by Israel. One of the main focuses in the development of the F-4 Terminator was upgrading its avionics system. Modern avionics systems were introduced, including new radars, improved navigation and communication systems, and more advanced fire control systems. Some of the Israeli-made devices embedded in the F-4 Terminator are, 1. The Elbitzilov 976 wide-angle head-up display, HUD, and hands-on throttle and stick, HOTAs, flight controls, 2. Higher performance Elta EL M2032 multimode airborne fire control radar, 3. Elta EL L8222 electronic countermeasures pod, 4. Dual MAL STD 553B data bus avionics package, 5. And slash ALQ 178 passive self protection suite, 6. New UHF slash VHF radio antennas and onboard multifunction displays, 7 new GPS slash INS precision targeting navigation equipment. One of the results of the upgrade, the F-4 Terminator can carry more guided weapon variants, including being able to launch AIM-120 Amram air-to-air missiles. With the current specifications, the Turkish Air Force plans to continue operating the F-4 Terminator until 2030. From its history, Turkey began operating the F-4 Phantom in 1974. The Turkish Air Force, Turkish Air Force, first ordered the F-4 Phantom II in 1967 from the US.